So we've done the eyes before, so I kind of I'm kind of going to go a little through it a little quick and let's go. Just follow. Again, it's kind of hard to do this when I got my hands stretched out a little bit. I'm stretched out a little bit, and you're just going to follow. There's a shallow, and then sharp up. Here it is, shallow up, sharp down, sharp down, shallow up. And then I, what I want to do is I want to dig deep on both sides. Turn around. Because then I want to take them. So bring this up there. Can I bring this up? And then where's our light? Our light source. We're going to bring this up. And you want to take that little chip out? Take this little chip out. Even though I got my reading glasses on, I still got to pull away a little bit so I can get into focus. Take a little chip out. Now we want to round the eyes just a little bit. We want to come up, or in this case, down because we're upside down. Pardon me. And then from here, go up. Okay, bring it on. Now we just, oh, what we're doing now is we're just rounding the eyeball. Just make it like an eyeball. Shape it like a ball. And I want to keep going until I got that pencil mark out. Now again, I would have my visor on so I can get it more cleaner, but I'll, I'll clean it up a little, a little later. I just want to make sure I show you how I did this. Now usually, while I'm on this eye, I'm going to just kind of clean out the pencil a little bit. Or anything else that needs to be cleaned out. And then I want to do I have to clean that pencil out. I have to make it a chisel in there. I just want to scoop right here. Scoop. Scoop. For the lower eyelid while I'm at it. Okay, let's go back over here now. We're going to go up. No, oh, sorry. Up. I'm trying to make this into a little ball in there because that's what it is, an eyeball. Yeah, I can wish I had my... I could have still done that. I had the goggles on. I think I did that in other videos. Clean up pencil mark. Clean up that pencil mark there. Got to clean up that one. Well, <sighs> okay. Then while I'm at it, I'll just scoop here, or you can take a small number nine, and bring it across. I just like to, you know, kind of maybe too lazy to <sighs> pick up another chisel. Put the knife down. Put it, another chisel in my hand. I guess I don't know. Some cleaning in there. Okay, my small V. Oh, up and around. Okay, up and around. Getting there. I want to take my 
the detail knife tip. And I want to make that, uh, I want to dig this a little deeper here by just, I'm following up around the eyeball is what I'm doing right here. Not come around. And I just want to make, just take a little bit of just a, probably like a couple of degree angle on that. So it really sinks the eye back a little bit. I wonder what this kind of got something goofed up in there. Same thing on this side. I think I might do it this way. So just enough to take some wood out. Now while we're at it, we're going to take the knife that follows along here, but you want to cut here, cut that up. Take a chip out. I hope I didn't take too much on that side. I may take more on this side. Okay, there's his eyes. <laughs> With the exception of some cleaning. Now here's the reason why I wanted to wait until we get the eyeballs in. There you go. Now you can see from this spot here, and it kind of goes back. And here we have the, what do I call it, the bone line here. Uh, eyebrow bone. And that's why if you look at here, he kind of has got sort of a fat forehead. And, uh, and I want to know how much I'll have to dig down after I have the eye in. So I'm going to do this first. I'm going to do a, I'm going to scoop here first to bring that eyebrow line. And remember, I want to go straight up because I don't want this to be a egg head. And then this is where we're going to get more this out of here. We're just getting the eyebrow bone in. So, so if we scoop here, it's going to come straight this way. It's going to come and then so it's still straight up. Maybe do a little bit of trimming, but See, now the forehead is starting to look. Now here's my question. Is the eyeball too far back? Well, I'm not 100% sure. I think if I were to do this, I think I might need to do this. This is the time to make adjustments to bring that eye back, or actually the eye forward. Eye front, because usually I myself I get the eyeball back farther than it should, and then I have too much forehead. So just a little bit of rounding, but he's still square. Ouch. So I think I'm relatively pleased. I think I should have, I wish I would have brought the hair down a little more, but I think I might have too much forehead. No. I think he turned out to have a little too much more forehead. And I think I can, what I'll do is I can bring this down a little more. But, how does that look as far as but before I do that, before I play with that, let me get my, where's that uh, same number, small number nine. This is what I did with my greening pumpkin. and But this one, I'm not going to go as deep. You want to go at a 45 degree angle this way, about a 30 degree angle up this way. And you want just a little bit. It's not going to be as deep as... The pumpkin turn around 45 this way 30 this way okay, 
get that out of there. Yeah, it is kind of a little chippy, isn't it? Is it because of my chisel is not? Is it my chisel is not clean? Yeah, that is really chippy. How'd it get be so chippy? I think I'll have to wait until we start doing details to clean that up. How did that get so dang chippy? Wow, that is just really bad. See if we can do some salvaging here. What the heck? <sighs> well, let's bring this eyebrow back a little bit. I think I'll have to do that during cleanup here. It's, I don't know how that got so darn chippy. <sighs> oh, goodness. It's like it's, he's got like a psoriasis or something. <sighs> well, I'm just going to have to work on it a little later. Comes time to clean up. Okay. Like I said, I want to bring the bring the head down a little bit. I do think that's what I needed because I still want some more hair up on top. Oops, careful I don't round it. <sighs> of course, we don't want him to be Frankenstein's creature either. Just round up a little bit. My hands are going to get a little chippy up here, too. Now I want to round this a little bit. I think I might need to sharpen my knife. I think that's the thing. I think that's a little better. A little better. Oh, I need to round this just a little bit. Oh. 